company, Brenda, to a red carpet event in Rome last night. And I was asking Sam for details. Yeah, I'm aware. Well, I guess I'm the only one who didn't know about it. I guess Brenda has got herself involved in something, and her boyfriend can't handle it, so now she's got to involve Jason. Well, it appears that Jason was acting as her bodyguard. You guys, it's not a big deal. Not the guy Brenda can't get over. Look, I saw the red carpet photo. I know Brenda, I know that. Look, she's crazy about you. Look, I know that she wasn't expecting her to run back into you again, but obviously something changed. Uh, no, nothing's changed. What, she called you? No, she didn't call you me. You called her. You no, know, I it didn't doesn't call matter. Her. Exes always get they get together again sometimes. It happens. But I love her. Okay, I want to make sure that you should be talking to Brenda about okay, me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you, what are you doing? You're discussing me? Jason isn't buying into Brenda's drama. He's just being loyal, because that's that's how he thinks. But she doesn't need Jason. She's a laundry list of guys that could help her. True, but if something wasn't wrong, Jason would be back here by now. Sorry, I couldn't be any more help, guys. I gotta go. Please do not discuss me behind my back. It's my fault. No, no. Of course, it's not your fault. You... Hi. Hi. I can't believe. I'm just. I'm happy to see you. I'm just well, I'm so yeah, surprised. I'm happy to see you, too. Look, I just didn't like how we left things, so I wanted to set things straight with the guy that you left me for, so that's why I'm here. Oh, no, Jason isn't the guy I left you for. Uh, I, I tried to tell him that. Yeah, I'm sure you did. Listen, he is absolutely not the guy that I was talking to you about. Are you kidding me? I've never seen you so fired up. Didn't you say that the guy you left me for made you crazy? He, he made you... Yeah, 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 yes, yes, I, I, yes. He, he, well, he actually does make me crazy. Not the good kind of crazy, but he is, however, incredibly good at saving people. Okay, I wish nothing but the best for the two of you. No, no, you're not listening this to is... me. You, I, th this is not the guy that I was talking about. He's here to protect me. Like a bodyguard? Yes. One that yes. you happen to have been married to, one that you oh, call out to when you need help. That or something. I was married to him, Someone who you'll let look, take care of you when you won't let anyone before. else take care of you. Are you listening to me? He's here for security reasons. That's it. Okay, well, if it's not him, then who did you leave me for? <laughs> Crazy not to keep this woman. Oh, Murphy, please listen to me. This is not the guy. I am never going to see that guy again. I'm going to wait in the hall. No, everyone needs to calm down for a second. Murphy and I know where we stand with each other. You know that I'm never going to make you happy. You already have. So that's how it is, huh? Look, I, I have no idea what's going on right now, but I do know that you are a wonderful, generous person. Please take care of her. Crazy to let him go, right? Amazing. But, uh, you know, I, I don't know. I, he would gladly take me to any gala, unlike some people I know. I'll then be with him. He doesn't make me happy. Because of Sonny. You know that I would do anything for Sonny, all right? I don't happen to have that feeling in my gut about Murphy. So if I married him, I'd end up leaving him eventually in one way or another, and there is nothing worse than being left. So I am not going to do that to him. Who's there? Suzanne. Thank you. You see how it's done? You find out who's at the door, and then you answer it. <laughs> yeah, well, Jason's a trained professional, right? Speaking of which, that picture on the internet, it's causing quite a commotion. People think you're dating Jason. Ah, oh, great. Good news. I appreciate that you're taking care of Brenda. And God knows you look great on camera. But you are a representative at VASEC, and our mission is to save exploited children. We can't have people thinking you're going out with a hitman. Hey, 
Harvey. I'm sorry. I probably should have called. I was just wondering if Jason was here. No, not yet. Brenda's obviously kind of a handful. Yeah, okay. Uh, it's no big deal. See ya. Hey, wait. Uh, actually, it is a big deal. To me. Anyway, I was, I was wondering if maybe you could help. Uh, yeah. What do you, um... You mean help? Well, okay, here it goes. I miss Jason, and I really can't wait for him to get home, but I'm really worried about him. Oh, oh. Sam, Jason loves you a lot. I wouldn't worry about Brenda. No, this has absolutely nothing to do with Brenda. Okay, here it goes. Jason's been acting kind of different since he's been back from Pentonville. And I, I know something happened in prison and he won't tell me. I can tell it's bothering him and I really want to help. I just don't know where to start. Uh, you know what, Sam? Sorry, but I can't help you there. Really? When you were there, you must have seen something. I just, I, I don't want Jason walking around in so much pain anymore. So I'm just, I'm just kind of asking you what you think, you know? Should I press the issue and try and get him to talk to me? Or should I pretend that everything is fine, even though I, I know it isn't? I had no idea that Jason had been tried for murder. Twice. Or that he's just been released from prison. You were in prison? Yeah, for a little while. Why don't you tell me? Because I'm out. Why were you in prison? Were you convicted of something? Mm, no charge, no. Nothing. Charge of a drug. Oh, great. So what's the problem? Well, think how it will look. Organized crime is at the center of the child sex trafficking industry. A and most of the sweatshops and, and uh, diamond mines that we're trying to shut down are run by crime syndicates. We can't have you popping up all over the internet with a professional criminal oh, as an whoa, escort. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold, 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 hold on a second. He's not a professional criminal. He's a bodyguard. All right, this is a man who would kill someone if they hurt a child. We will spend so much time explaining why he's around, it'll take us off message. No. Look, I don't have a problem with you, but the people who give us money will see it differently. I understand. No, you don't understand. He's staying here to protect me. He's not leaving. Look, nobody wants to talk about Benville. Especially Jason, who really doesn't have much to say in the first place. Uh, if Jason doesn't want to talk about what happened, you have to respect that. Yeah. You're probably right. You know, and, and if it was too much, and if it, I didn't mean to bring... Dad, hey. hey. What are you doing? I didn't know you were here. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to see you. I'm not late. Supposed to be seeing you. Yeah, I know. It's it's uh, we didn't plan this, and I didn't know you were here. And and I'm gonna go because I have stuff to do. All right. Good to see you. Good to see you. I had known all the details of your life. I never would have called you. You had to call him. He's my emergency contact. I'll make sure all your security recommendations are implemented. With who? Cartula? They're not good enough. Well, then you'll just have to cut back on your appearances. No, I will not. I'm going to keep all of my commitments, and he is staying to protect me. Jason is no longer an option. I'm sorry. Thank you for all the work you did. I'm sure it wasn't easy. You didn't want me here in the first place, and now I'm leaving. You should be happy. I'm fine. Jason. I, I just I just want you to know I appreciate you dropping everything and coming here. I I think the work you're doing for the kids is important. Just be careful. You should go, right? Yeah, I just want to say that I don't think the Balkan's actually trying to kill you. I think he's trying to take you for some reason. Look. If Sonny asks you how I am... Yeah? 
This is what I want you to tell him. I want you to tell Sonny I'm doing great. But you're not. I want you to tell him that I'm doing great and that I'm working with these kids who need me and that my life has purpose so that he can go on without me. If he asks, I'll, I'll tell him something. Amazing. Well, you have all my numbers, so if you need anything, you just, you know, call me. Hey, uh, hey, um... You know I want Sonny to have a good life, right? Yeah, I'll tell him. All right, bye. Is it really goodbye? Yes, goodbye. 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 Do you ever take Karen to this place?